Lolly Ho, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Eternal Ring. Uh, so, spoiler alert, I actually just used uh, Magic Stones, because 2 MP per kill, and you have 500 MP total. Nah, we're not killing 300 Sagan today. <clears throat> nope. But, what we are doing is making very, very bad decisions. So... Yeah, I'm, you can say I'm dreading this. The biggest thing is, is that there's a couple items in here that are kind of useless. Uh, I'm not going to be going for them. Like, the random rings of magic. We have how many rings of magic? Twelve. We don't need any more means of magic. Also, um, I kept... So these four I have because of... Poison is a really good uh, technique for quick fire. Uh, tornado is like the most damaging thing I have. Protect is good to have. Curing water is good to have. I haven't really decided what to put here, honestly. Uh, there is a spell I wish I had. Um... But, we'll make do. I think, maybe I'll put Ice Wall, just because of the freezing effect. It's, uh, more directable than Ice Trap, too. It does make our fire very weak, but we'll make work. Make it work. Uh, we will not need, uh, Ring of Truth, I don't believe. Let me glance through my maps. Yeah, we won't need the Ring of True Sight. Okay, so we can take off True Sight. It doesn't even give us any buffs. So... I don't want to equip the Ring of Sacrifice yet. Um, Branch, along with... Uh... Don't think it's actually nice. I'm going to think I'm going to equip Branch. Because Branch, along with Seek, is... Should be really powerful if I understand correctly. Uh, growth is actually a good stat boost, so I'm gonna keep growth. Clarity is a must have for a while. We're gonna keep inside equipment too, so here we go. <sighs> Welcome to the Sealed Labyrinth. Uh, this area is full of very, very powerful monsters. Uh, hello, Fire Rat. So, even if they're normal monsters, they are a ton stronger than monsters would normally be here. Uh, let's see if I can sample. But no, well, these things die pretty quickly. They drop Fire Dragon and Earth Dragon gems. So, while their HP is not buffed up, their I think their attack is. There is an enemy in here. Oh, okay, that about scared the devil out of me. Uh, we're just gonna wait here for that to blow up. Water Dragon Gem. Thank you. Um, so yeah, that's a loop that we don't need to go through. I'm going to be basically blazing through this place. Uh, I'm going to protect and use it, keep it up. Uh, for multiple reasons. Oh god, that, that rat just scared the devil out of me. That worked. There is another enemy that I'm actually a little scared of. Uh, okay, let's go this way. Maybe I won't need protect. I'm gonna. Oh, Lord, there they are. Thank you, double ice wall. Okay, come on, let it jump. Attack! So, I've already done more damage to this thing than I do to most enemies. Uh, 
Got it. Oh, and that's a normal enemy here, Fire Dragon Gem, of course. Oh, by the way, there's not going to be any deuses down here, so... Wait. It's actually not the way I want to go, is it? Oh, crap, I've already lost my sense of direction. Uh, I think this is the way I want to go. That's a rat. Okay, yeah, I think this is the direction I want to go. It should be lined up with my map. Yeah, here we go. Okay. This is the way I want to go. There is a thing to the left I can get. It's a magic ring. A plain magic ring. I'm not going to worry with it. Because I just want to get to the end of this area. This area has some really cool treasures throughout it. But... This floor is good for farming. To be completely honest with you, if you want to do some farming before... I knew it! yourself get caught by these guys. These things are by far the strongest thing in this area. Well, for now at least. See how much mana I'm going through? <laughs> okay, this is a big open area. I think the two werewolves were the strongest thing here, but don't underestimate the, bat the brats. Just because they can do damage to you. But it's not over yet. Each floor has a mini boss of sorts that I know if I remember correctly. And this one is a water devil, I think is what this thing is actually called. But ah, running away, running away. So that did enough damage that I have to heal myself twice. fight this guy with just bare lamelees. Come on. Come on. I do not want to have to fight that water devil while you're still alive. Also, I want to say that these guys can inflict paralyze or something on you. I think it's paralyze. Boss over there, and he didn't drop anything, of course. Oh, and he's looking right down the middle. Oh, this is not good. Ew. He's shooting through the wall at me. This is gonna do a lot. Okay, I'm in the room now. Now I can fight him for real. This is exactly the same fight as the uh, the one at the end of the water temple, water shrine, whatever, but at a much higher difficulty. <laughs> Oh, and he can jump out of his slide now. <laughs> Alright, let's see. 
this is going to cost me a lot of mana, but it should do a fair amount of damage. Unless he's just immune to it, that would also suck. Okay, so he's immune to wind. Wouldn't be surprised if he was immune to water, but apparently not. See how many hits this guy is taking? I don't think you have to fight this guy, but I want this guy dead. You get a reward for killing him. Dance of death right here. Stop hopping away like that. God. Oh, Lord, he's dead. And in his place, he drops the fortune ring. Okay, so. The fortune ring. Doubles probabilities of enemies dropping items. It's worth lowering my physical attack by just a little bit. So, are you ready for round two? Welcome to floor two of the Sealed Labyrinth. The first thing we're going to do is pop a magic stone or two. Wait, are they still set to my... Yeah, they are. Get ourselves back up in MP. So, this place. Oh, this place. Sorry, my ears. Itchy. I'm trying to. Ugh. I 
hate when I'm right here. It's just so. I think it's these headsets I've been wearing them most of the day. <laughs> see, you see the fire there? Oh, but there's nothing there. Whoa! It's a rat! I used the healing button by accident. Oh. Yeah, this place has basically ghost enemies. Joy, fun. Not really fun at all. Oh god. So, the ghost rats, you're not gonna pin down. You can kill them, but you're not pinning them down. Remember when I said that I need to learn how to fight these guys? This is one of the reasons why. And we get the Create Life Ring. We'll look at that in a second. And the Dark Pact Ring. So as I said uh, before, the light and dark elements are basically polars of each other. The Create Life, they both say the same thing, but they're actually mistaken. Create Life is the one that consistently heal, constantly heals HP, and the Dark Pack constantly heals MP, it's typo. Um, so yeah, you can, it's like one point every eight seconds or something like that. Um, in this case, I'm gonna replace Clarity. Absolutely wrong way, but it'll be okay. I actually want Ice Wall equipped. Oh lord. Yeah. Yeah, that should tell you what these guys are. I think only magic might be able to hit them now that I'm looking at it. Because they have no physical form. Okay. Whoa, hello. Ah, I caught him. Oh, look, a light dragon gem. Okay, this should be. Oh. Right. Yee, don't be hit by that. wait for it to start walking, in, or if you don't, it could end up hitting you. Anyway, I need to go south here. Oh right, um, the trees constantly produce invisible puffer enemies. And these crabs are very, very lethal. Just like everything else in here. I need to get rid of everything here. Wow. That didn't do much. But what if I use poison? Woo! That scared the bitches out of me. I don't think the crabs here actually aggro you unless you attack them. Like, see, I've woken this one up, so... That 
That one has isn't moving at all though because I haven't woken it up. Make sure that thing wasn't gonna put me into a spot I couldn't do anything with. So yeah, you can kill the crabs here. Uh oh. That crab just got hit by that floating cloud thingy. And now it's after me. I can't tell if these things are taking any damage. Thing to these thing. Where's that other crab? Because I know I have another crab that's spinning over there somewhere. That was close. I knew there was a second one. How much HP these crabs have? Oh my lord. How terrible is my damage? it to blow up on them. Well, that's not good, because he was sat down for a second. Oh my god, I finally killed one. So yeah, this is a thing. And if you don't use magic to kill these things, you're probably doing it wrong. I'm actually going to have to retreat at this point, because this is taking entirely too long. But you can see the gist of it. These guys are super powerful. They are going to deal a lot of damage if you catch me. And some enemies are able to be farmed, but is it worth it? That about scared the devil out of me. and poison. Wonderful. The poison doesn't really worry me as much as the paralyzed does. I mean, the poison I can deal with.
Oh, hey. Dark Dragon Gem. Paralysis were off. Nice. Dark, nice. And this is another dark that that was dropped earlier. I was simply trying to stay alive. Okay. North doesn't have anywhere. Where am I at? Oh crap! Okay, no north does have a place. Okay. This way has a place too. Oh great! Let's just run for it. I think this is the way I want to go. I'm also going to boost up Protect. Wait, where am I at? Okay, I think I know where I'm going. Yeah. Oh, Ring of Magic. Oh. Oh, I know where I am. I went the, all the wrong way. Okay. I see where I am. I need to go back this way. Go up. Up through here. Go past these guys. There's, yeah, there's nothing this way. Okay, good. Hello, Ghost Trap. Just go straight through. Ignore all the crap happening behind me. I really wish this ghost trap would go away. Well, there's anything in here, though. What about in here? Do you not follow me, ghost trap? Okay, yep. We're ready to go. There was no mini boss to this fight, Thor Fang, thankfully. Oh, but I don't think we'll get that lucky on this floor. Welcome to the third floor of the Sealed Labyrinth. Everything is icy white. And now we have... Ah, crap. <sighs> There's a cockatrice over there. That's what it is. Okay, I don't care about the poison, I gotta get rid of this paralysis, though. There is a spell you're expected to have by now, that I just unfortunately don't. You know what? Ice Ball is turning out to be my best friend. Freeze the enemy solid, get a good couple of hits in, and then retreat.
I hear that thing in the background. These are a lot more apt to use their electric attack than the original ones. Even using it when you're nearly point blank range. Okay. And for our rewards, we get Dragon Fangs. So, that was an Air Dragon Fang, which increases your wind attribute. Permanently increasing our resistance to wind. If I'm not mistaken, this is just a loop. Yeah, it's just a loop. A pointless, pointless loop. So... Oh god, there's a lizard man. There's also another cockatrice. Okay, we are bolting. This is a place that we want nothing to do with. Just try to freeze him solid, get him out of the way, and retreat. Okay, fortunately, he's leaving us alone, so... Oh, this area is so... Fortunately, things don't usually follow us very far. I'll take another Dragon Fang. I think that was an Earth Dragon Fang. I'll be over there with that later. Okay, where is this? This is just the dead end, right? Yeah. Emphasis on dead. <laughs> oh no. Okay, hold up. Protect on. Poison balls at the ready. Ow. I mean, stuck. Gold, I think, is light, and silver is. Dark, we're just gonna outrun the lizard man. Eventually, he will stop. I don't know when that is, though. Ow. Okay, we wanna go north here. I hear a cockatrice. Okay, it looks like there's only one. Oh god, there's the cockatrice. Of course, ow. Of course, there's a cockatrice here. <sighs> I hate cockatrice. I hate having to deal with them with everything else here, too. Alright. Why are you still following me? Huh. I honestly say I didn't expect that. Why did my tornado go into the wall there? So these guys are not fun. There's only one of them, it wouldn't be so bad. But having to dodge the projectiles of the second one while the first one tries to bite me and hit me. <laughs> Killed by his friend, I see. Now there's only one of you. You're still annoying, but. I have to be careful about running gun ho. <sighs> then there's him.
great Gokutra saw me. Ice Wall is probably my best bet, actually, because you may increase my ice power. I have anything to increase? I don't really have anything to increase my water anymore, except for sacrifice. So. Ice Trap would do it. Okay. So if I'm going to be using Ice Wall... Not what I thought it was. Okay, hold up. What? Okay, wait a second. I think I know where I am. If I go this way. Yeah, okay. That way goes this way. I want to go this way and then turn left as soon as I can. Alright, come on. Get a ice wall. Okay, so I should have just come into here, so I should be able to get going straight, and there's a path to the right, yep, okay. Oh, great. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Of course there's one of those guys. Yeah, so that little thing that flies with him is designed to prevent magic from working on him. Oh, great, there's another... They're chasing me. Okay. 
It actually blocked it. Wow, I'm impressed, actually. Going this way now. Okay, good. Now I can focus a little bit. Oop. I missed. if they try to stop Ice Trap. Yeah, yeah they do, actually. really sad. This is not the last floor of this place. into that. I, again, walked into that. Oh, 
How close are you to dying? Again, I walked into it. Getting sloppy. That was an accident. like one damage per hit or something. The hilarious part is I'm a higher level than what I normally am when I come down here. these guys, but I want the goodies in that room. It's too dangerous for this guy in there. In fact, I don't actually remember if this guy drops the goodies or not. No, he's just a normal enemy. Oh, there's still another enemy in there that drops it. Okay, first off, let's heal our man out a little bit. Let's get a protect, switch to curing water, and see what's in here. And there it is. Another cockatrice. And things in the corner of the room to annoy me. I just heard another one of those birds. Let's cast Protect real quick. Yeah, we're not fighting that one. Stop trying to snipe me. He's annoying as a partner because his bird will try to protect the cockatrice. Unfortunately, though, his magic actually counts as attack against the cockatrice, and that's what I need. Grabbing it and going. Burn edge. Now getting the heck out of dodge. Oh, great, there's another one of those things. Can I outrun it is the question. Oh, great, I may have outran it too far. I just went the wrong way. I think it just went the wrong way, actually. This is where I need to go. Yeah, this is where I fought him in. Okay, so we're gonna pause a moment. And. <sighs> okay, Power of Branch has been nice, but. Burn Edge. Ghost Sword in Fire, adding to the fire attribute. Ice Wall actually builds strength. This is Ice Trap. Okay. So Ice builds strength, huh? Let's, let's put Floating Bomb on there. We're gonna keep Protect, but the reason I did that is to boost my Fire Attribute. Now my fire, my weapon's on fire. Oh great, you're mad. That should increase our attack power by a tremendous amount by comparison to what we were doing. It's not going to make us a god or anything, but it's definitely helpful. Enemies respawning, I need to be basically getting the heck out of here. So let's find Protect, pop it, switch over to Curing Water, and hope. Hope I'm going the right way. I'm gonna outrun this guy. At least try. Oh, great, there's two of these guys just waiting for me. Ow! Ignore them. 
Ignore him for sure. Left, run to the right. Big room with a bunch of stuff in it that I want nothing to do with. There was a dying lizardman there at one point, but uh oh, there's another dying lizardman. Bye. And now. Folks. <laughs> I'm trying to get my map to load, but apparently my map doesn't want to load. Come on now. Uh, I'm just trying to remember which way is which. Don't go straight, by the way. Not so you've explored the side panels. I do know that much. I remember that much. Apparently my uh, web page broke. Wonderful. But I had my map on. Okay. Remember the night guys a moment ago. Also, some of the best music in the game. Okay, we're just gonna go for it. They're already awake. Can I just simply run through them? No, I bet they drop the item. Oh boy. Now, as long as we leave them alone, we'll do a lot. damage to each other, but they will... Crap. Defeating any... Defeating the correct one here will make things go a lot faster in the end. Yeah, this isn't working. makes this take longer. one long video. I may even break it up just to make things easier. Eee. 
That was the wrong spell. I was thought I was still on protect. I had a clue as to which one A dropped what I wanted and B was closer to death. Without that was a terrible idea. That should not have paid off, but did. Yeah. I think I just got saved by the second one that the shot. Let's go this way this time. literally blew up the one that the... I think I just hurt myself doing that. I did. The only way to use magic on is to hurt myself with the spell. That's pretty hilarious. I'd love to drop Ice Trap under their feet, but I don't think it's gonna work. I have to be on top of them. Oh no, they're, they're blocked from it. Right, right, right. It actually just does not work on the outright. The way to freeze them is to hit them with ice wall, and I have to get lucky enough to actually hit them with it, and not their bird that instantly teleports onto it. Oh great, now I'm paralyzed. Okay, gonna play keep away for a moment. annoying to have an enemy that strips away your magic. It would be really hilarious if this is the side that has the item that I would need to fight these guys for. But I think I do. I'm pretty sure that I do at this point. Because I should have been able to already get it if I didn't. I don't see it on the ground anywhere. Trying to kill the other enemies in this room with these guys around is just a suicide. Now something you can do is use summons against them, because I'm pretty sure that type of magic, which we haven't gone into yet, uh, ignores these little birdies. So if you farm the first couple of floors and then come back down, congratulations, you have some pretty strong magic to use against these guys. But I like doing this all in one shot as a uh, sort of a self-challenge. 
unfortunately, it does mean that these battles take a little bit longer than you'd expect. I wish I knew how much damage I was doing. Probably the only real complaint I have is because of the freestyle of the movement and such, there's no way to really give the enemies a health bar. So you have no idea how much or how little damage you're doing. to abort that attack. I don't know what else to say about this. Unfortunately, this is the battle. It's just a long process of trying to kill these guys so that they drop the item I need to get from here. That'll make the rest of the area a little bit easier. And then basically the same thing on the other side of the, the hallway. I just wish I had a spell that could reach the stupid birds. probably is a spell designed to reach them. I just don't have it equipped. Also, you know, one thing that had helped is Branch actually created two of them. And I think that's going to be more powerful than, than this at the moment. Because being able to have two ice walls did mean, or does mean, that there's only, there's two projectiles and the birds have to go for one of them. Now there's two birds, so that doesn't help as much as it could. Also, now I'm paralyzed. So I'm paralyzed. I'm paralyzed at some point. There is a spell you can have far beyond now. Yeah, I could use those real quick, but not right this moment. Oh, I'm just gonna... Okay. Oh, come on with your paralysis. <sighs> Alright, you got me spinning around. What you gonna do now? I hit both of them with that. Okay, one died. He did not drop the item I needed. But he did drop an Elder Fang. But that means this one's gonna drop it. Uh... What is that? But is it already on the ground? Oh my god, I'm gonna feel like an idiot. Where is it? Oh god, which side am I on? Am I on the side with the ring? Because there's a, one side has a ring, and the other side has a, a weapon. I'm not seeing it though. Wait, is it hidden? They would. Uh, 
Um, no, they, they wouldn't, actually. Hmm. It's not hidden by one of these guys, is it? Probably is. These are the same crabs that we fought earlier, but a lot stronger. And you can do this to make them easier. I almost feel like I should have practiced ran through here so I can know where everything is. You know what I just realized? I didn't have to go this way at all yet. And I'm an idiot. Okay. <sighs> so, basically I finally got my web browser to agree with me and reopen the map. You don't want to go all the way forward, but follow the wall. Is it protected? Oh, it's one of those. Oh, well that's actually quite easy. Pretty sure it retains its weakness. Wait, no, that's management. I need to find. Am I on divine? No, I'm not on divine. Hello. Nice try. Goodbye. The Kaiser Knuckle. The Kaiser Knuckle is the ultimate weapon for physical attacks. However, it diminishes your strengths and your magic by a tremendous amount. But it's also the fastest weapon in the game. <laughs> Oh, it's just a divot. Okay. Now, straight across from this entrance... Yeah, don't let that fool you. That pale white sog in there is probably the scariest thing in here for the most part. And I don't think it's vulnerable to divine. I missed. Yeah, pretty sure it just blinked off of it. Oh, was it not? Okay. I thought that thing, maybe I actually let that thing hit me one time. Anyway, Animated Sword. That name is a little bit of a misnomer. It creates an illusionary sword to perform multiple attacks. So what does that mean? Within the attack frame, within one attack frame, you now attack four times. So, let me go back to that room where I was fighting those those enemies, and let's kill a few crabs, shall we? We want to get as many of those Elder Dragon Frangs as we can. Kaiser Knuckle does have issues hitting these guys, though.
Bing. But it punches them hard enough that it actually forces them up. There it is. <sighs> the little the weird hitbox on these guys is the worst problem. Anyway, yeah, we're not going to fight any more of those guys, but there is something I do want to fight. You can level grind in this area if you like to earn some of those Elder Dragon Fangs. We're going to go ahead and use all the, the Dragon Fangs we have. both of them. Okay. So first off, let's set the golden grass just to be safe. Second off, we're going to focus all of our power into our physical strength. So we're going to lose the power of Seek for now, and we're going to equip a sacrifice. We do not want to die in what we're about to do. Once you feel you've done enough grinding, head this way. Straight on. Like I said, not to go in the beginning. Once you jump down here, there is no returning. And... Ow. Switch to Curing Ring. Welcome to the hardest fight in the game. So first off, this jerk is one of the freaking guys that has the unlimited uh, magic protection. Now the ghosts die quick, but they do a lot of damage and they curse you. Don't bother removing curse uh, if you can help it until you kill all of these guys. Of course, you can just go in with Protect Active, but I forgot to put it on, so... Alright. So we're going to remove our Curse, because the last thing we need is reduce the stats. We're going to equip Ice Roll. We're going to hope we can catch him with it. I might need to equip Branch. Oh wait, no, I still have Branch, don't I? Now, he just took, like, eight hits. Turn, you get a ring of magic, of course, and the eternal sword. So, this sword is not as strong as the Kaiser Knuckle, but it's an Elysian magic weapon with all attributes. It does the exact opposite of what the Kaiser Knuckle does and ends up turning you into essentially a god. The only downside is with the animated sword, it looks like you're flailing miserably with your, with your sword. Um, but this sword is the reason you come down here, along with the animated sword and Kaiser Knuckle. You can go through the game without these items, 
but trust me, you're going to want to play around with them. And that is the Sealed Labyrinth. Now, I will be going in there to get gems together for the magic spells, because, let's face it, I would like to show off all of the different uh, summoning spells, and part of those are the dragon summons. There are other... there's another set of summoning spells as well, but I'll have to go find places to farm the other gems for those.